Hey crafty friends, this is Mary. Today we're going to make a card for the Countdown to Christmas series. We're going to use a Cards TV sketch. We're going to use Cricut Snow Friends. And we're also going to use a set of Cards TV stamps called Snow Day. So come on back and we'll get started. <laughs> I'm so glad you stopped by today, guys. I'm so happy to have you here. And if this is your first time at Cards TV, I hope you'll take just a second to tap that subscribe button. And don't forget to ring that little notification bell so you'll be notified each time I post a new video. Now, as I said, we're going to be using Cards TV sketch number 28. You can get all the sketches. There are 35 of them right now over at my blog, cardstv.blogspot.com, and they're free to download. And we're going to be using the Cricut Snow Friends cartridge, and you can see this is from 2009-2010, so it is an oldie. I had to go way back in the Cricut vault for that one. But I did a print and cut, so I used my Explorer for this one. I'll have the measurements that I used to cut out my little snowman. But if you have a Cricut Expression and you have this cartridge, I'll have the measurements for that as well. So you can also make this card. Now for our sentiment, we're going to be using the Cards TV stamp set called Snow Day. And you can find this over at the Cards TV stamp store online. And let me tell you it, just a few of the ones that are on here. We've got Snow Day. Snowman Will Melt Your Heart. I love that one. From One Flake to Another. Thank You So Much. Snow, What's New? Winter Wonderland, Cabin Fever. Snowmen Are Built One Flake at a Time. Dashing Through the Snow. Your Snow Much Fun. Baby It's Cold Outside. And the one we're going to use today, There's Snow One Like You. Now, if you go and purchase this set, over at the Cards TV stamp store, I'm going to give you as a free gift a set of Tiny Tidings stamps. As long as the supply lasts of these two. I don't have a lot of snow day. So if you want this one, guys, you need to hurry on over to pick that up. But Tiny Tidings has lots on here, and they're just the right size when you have just a little small space. We've got Merry Christmas, of course, Jingle All the Way, Jingle Bells, Happy Holidays, Candy Cane Kisses, Naughty or Nice, Merry and Bright, Happy Holidays, May Your Holidays Be Sweet, Friends Are the Best Presents, From Our House to Yours, and we've got Cheers to a New Year, if you want to do a New Year's card. So, if you're interested in this set, Hop on over quick, guys, because, as I said, I don't have a lot of these. Okay, let's get busy and make this card. This is a really quick and simple card to make, guys, and I seem to be doing a lot of that lately because I'm so busy, especially this time of year. We're all super busy. So this one's really quick but really cute. Now we look at the card sketch. We've got our card, which is four and a quarter by five and a half. I've already gone ahead and cut and scored this. Then we have a mat, three and a quarter by four and three quarters. So I've cut one out of this red and white stripe. But because I want it to really pop on this card base, even though I don't have the measurements on here, I cut one just a little bit bigger out of a dark red. And you can see how that really makes that stand out. And this one I cut, let's see, this is three and a quarter by four and three quarters. So this is three and three eighths by four and seven eighths. I'm going to take my art glitter glue and get these adhered together and get them right here on the front of my card. Next, we've got a border that's going across. And the border is one inch by three and three quarters. And this is a dark navy blue with white dots. And I think it looks like snow. So I'm going to get that attached right there with my art glitter glue. 
Our next element is this circle. This is a two and a half inch circle. You can use a die. You can use your Cricut to cut a circle. You can use a punch, whatever you have. And if you don't want to use a circle, use whatever shape you'd like to, guys. Just make this your own. And you can see I went ahead and stamped it using that Snow Day stamp set. There's no one like you. I'm going to put this down flat also with my art glitter glue. Now we're ready to add our snowman. And this is what makes this card so stinking cute. Look at that sweet little guy. Now I cut him with the Cricut Explore. And I did print and cut. So I cut him at 2 inches wide by 1.957 high. Now if you're going to cut him out with your uh, Cricut Expression and you have the cartridge, cut him out at 2 inches and he is called the Windy Snowman from Snow Friends. And I've got him on some foam tape and I'm going to pop him up on here. And he just makes this card. Okay, y'all, here's my finished card. And I think it turned out super cute. And it was so quick and easy. Just really, really quick and easy. Now, if you want to pick up this sketch, this was done with sketch number 28. Or if you want to get all 35, just go to my blog, cardstv.blogspot.com. And they're all free to download. And you can keep them in a little book like I do with mine. And when you're stumped for a card idea, just flip through and find a sketch and you're good to go. And don't forget, guys, when you go and purchase the Snow Day stamp set, which is the one we used on our card today, you will get a set of tiny tidings for free. And I don't have a lot of them of the Snow Day stamp set. So hop on over if you're interested in that one. Thank you all so very much for coming by and spending some time with me today. I love you all. God bless you all. And I will see you again soon with another card. And happy Thanksgiving. Bye now.